Hi guys, today we will do some experiment about electric, uh, electrical phenomenon. And before we start, I think we need some theoretical background. Um, like uh, and we uh, know that if uh, we use a ruler and rub it on the hair, the, then the ruler can uh, attract some piece of paper, and we call it. If we call that the ruler is electrical electrically charged. Sorry. And uh, in uh, in the ruler, there is some there is some uh, there are some charge. It's the uh, is make the ruler can attract the piece of paper, and um, <clears throat> there's two types of charge. And it's a positive charge. We denote it by a plus sign and negative charge. Is a minus sign, um, and unlike charge, uh, unlike charge, like if we have one, uh, one positive charge and one negative charge, then it it will attract each other. And if we uh, have two uh, charges uh, with uh, the same, um, the same. Uh, uh, the same uh, side, so, like uh, two uh, positive or two negative, it will repel each other. It pulls each other away. Yes, that's the uh, theory we need for today. We have here a, mach a machine. We call it Wim Hertz machine. This machine can produce electric charge and uh, collect it, put it inside two, two jars. Uh, one, one jar is positive and one jar is negative. Uh, and yes, uh, I will show you how the jars repel or attract each other. Here I have an a uh, metal ball, a small metal ball. Between uh, between the uh, the sphere. Now, when we uh, run the machine, there will be uh, there will some charge on the sphere, and if <coughs> and we can charge this uh, this uh, ball by letting it touch. Uh, some sphere and see what happened. You can see that the metal ball swing back and forth, it touch the digital sphere then top disappear and go back. <coughs> That's because when, uh, let's say, if there is a positive charge, the ball touches it and uh, it uh, positively charges. Then, then these two guys, they repel each other and then it will move to this sphere. And this sphere is negatively charged. So, when this top, this, this guy top this guy, that is negatively charged, then it will be very charged again. So, the next part is, I have here a electroscope. Uh, it's made of a metal rod and a, a small, small uh, metal foil. And this metal foil can move, as you see. Uh, 
when I connect the electroscope with uh, The metal foil is swing uh, at an angle, and this is what happened. You look here. Uh, this is uh, the rod, and the foil. When I connect, uh, when I connect. The, this electroscope with the machine, then then is the the charge the charge the machine was produced will move to the rod, and the rod and the foil is post. Uh, let's say that is positive, positively charged. Then and light charge repel, so it repel each other, and you see an angle like this. But it's a ten four. This Yeah, it's 
shadow and you see the light of me.